Saber. Help me. Help me. I can't do this. Die. Okay. Oh no. Beaver, don't don't do this. Yo, what is up everyone? Hope all is going well for you. Welcome back to Get Jacked here on the official server. Now, what we're gonna be doing today is picking up where we left off and we're gonna go find us a beaver. It's been a while. I know a lot of people have mentioned it in the comments, but it's finally time to grab one because I'm getting really sick of harvesting wood. That's actually the hardest thing for me to get at the moment. We have dinosaurs for everything else except that. So I'm gonna find one of those, but I thought it would be nice first to actually take a look at all the dinos we do have already. So we've got the 178 Sarko and the 114 Sarko out here that we tamed up in the last video. Oh teleporting around but I thought I know I lose uh, dinosaurs you know just in the swamp sometimes also other players kill them every once in a while so it's really hard for you guys to keep track of what I've got so I want to take a little quick time at the beginning here to show you everything that we've got so far so we've got the 100 plus Dodicarus we've got the 197 Saber 140 Caprasuchus what are you 14 <laughs> oh my god you're embarrassing dude you're embarrassing me let me at least make you a little bit better what level does that put you at? 30? 31? Okay. 31 Diplocolis. That one is what I've been using for pearls, definitely. Um, we've got the frog. You could use a few more levels, too. That one's only 90. We could use a mated pair. I need to start getting pairs for these, but I want to kibble tame uh, more of them. So I need to get the kibble dinosaurs, which is going to be the next video. We're going to be grabbing tons of kibble dinosaurs next time. That's a little spoiler. But anyway, um... Let's throw a bunch of, oh my god, how many levels did you have? How many can I put into this guy? What do you think this will come out to be? Over 200%? Oh my god, he's been sitting here for so long. I was too scared to take him out, but now I'm definitely using this guy. We need to try this out for Prime. Next time. I still don't want to take him out. I still want to buff him up a little bit more. It's still a little dangerous to take this guy. He's, he's I don't want to lose him. But anyway, we've got our Procoptodon, we got him last time. Now, a lot of people gave me a bunch of tips on how to use him, so I think we might start using him as a, uh, a metal gatherer. Um, but anyway, we've got the Carno, basic Carno, and our Argent over here. And then, can't forget this little guy, Tapajara. Or, Tapajara, where did that come from? Archaeopteryx. I wish I had a Tapajara, I'll tell you that. Oh, that's cute. Oh, you must be able to mate these then. Ooh, we might... Might have to get us a little baby parachute. Okay, so let's see what we've got in here. I'll show you all the other dinosaurs. Now, they've been tucked away in here. Oh. Okay, if I could work a door. We got this. Close. Please? Please close. Okay, there we go. <laughs> we've got our Packy Rhino, the low-level guy. I still need to put him to use. We need to start luring some stuff to the base with that thing. Uh, Fiomia, this is the source of all the fertilizer for all the plant species X. And then this jumbled mess. Actually, there's a... Oh, oh no. Okay, let's see if I can get out of here. Scorpion, let me out. Cool. Okay. Um, we've got our scorpion here. I'm just going to move him so this doesn't happen again. Which, we had four, but the... Well, Allosaurus spawn, liked to spawn inside of here. Um, before but once I built enough stuff on the base I think they stopped doing that because the first probably two weeks on this location Allosaurus were just constantly spawning in here, and it sucked. I'm just gonna kind of organize these a little better now This raptor is a beast actually. I haven't used it. I, I actually use it to get uh, resources every once in a while because look at this We got like 2.5k health and I don't know. I've been buffing melee damage on him, too So he's pretty strong. Okay, so anyway now that we've seen everything that we have let's go get some more <laughs> so i want to find a beaver maybe we can find something else to tame up but uh, i need to head out and we'll see if we can find one okay so the first place i came to i know it's super dark this is only going to be for a second but i just wanted to show you the bay this is kind of like the stonehenge bay area located what is it like 85 50 like 85 55 or so now this is where is that a beaver oh yeah i found one what? Oh, God. oh, shoot. That was not. That was a Pelagornis. Crap. Okay. Well, none here. Next spot. All 
Alright, so we're about 52-29. That's another beaver spawn. Nice place to get uh, cementing paste from their nest. But hopefully we'll be able to find one over here. I haven't seen one yet. Oh my goodness. I'm struggling, guys. I really hate this mechanic. <laughs> I really hate how you can't... Oh, I was that close to land? Well, that's embarrassing. Oh. Well, looky here. What level are you, buddy? Five. Oh my god. Literally as low as they come. Oh, this is a dilemma. I've been searching for a little while, actually. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick this guy up. I'm going to hold on to him. We're going to check the other areas that these guys spawn at. Oh, is that one? No. Oh, my God. Am I blind? What? They don't... No beavers have spots. What is this? He was level 95, though. Why couldn't we get that? Now, where did that other guy go? Okay, we'll go grab him in a sec. I'm going to go loot these beaver nests first. <laughs> now, I actually built my first base ever in Ark. Uh, about, that was about two years ago now in this area, right up on that cliff up there on the other side of the Spino. What level are you, by the way? Oh, it's only 15. I almost... Oh, that would have been a nice tame, actually. But I don't... They're not even worth it to get unless they're at least 40 plus. So let's grab this quick. Might as well, might as well grab these when we're out here. But anyway, when I first built in this area, there were no redwoods. There was also no swamps. So this area was like a lot safer. Now it's really dangerous. But okay, let's go grab this one. Where'd that beaver go? Oh, I'll, hopefully I'll be able to find him. He's only level five, like I said. I sure, I really hope we can find one at the other spawns because that is that is low. That's really low. But I mean. We, we can't be picky if we can't find anything else. So, I'm going to grab the bird. We're going to go search the other spawns. We'll be right back. Alright, so now we're in the south. I checked the two upper river spawns around like 52, 60, and there wasn't anything there. Almost lost this one, actually. This is the other beaver, but he seems to be stuck for now. Am I, I going to be able to get you out of here? You're trying to hide from me, dude? I had to land to, to gain stamina, and he, he tried to try to get out of here. But he still, still got the level 5 one, unfortunately, because there weren't any at those spawns. And the Hidden Lake area is actually where the Alpha Tribe is on this uh, server, I believe. So I'm not going up there. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to steer clear. Um, so the wiki said that this was a spawn, spo uh, spawn point <laughs> for beavers. And it's right around, um, what is this one, 73, like, 50 no i'm sorry 7340 it's around 7340 and i've not seen any beavers and i don't think i've ever seen any beavers around here so i don't know about this one um but another another miss all right so brought this one back to base i actually looped around to that stonehenge bay area to hopefully find another one because this one's so low level i almost feel bad taming it uh, but it'll make the tame a little bit easier we're gonna need multiples of these anyway so i'll get another beaver eventually once maybe once we get kibble because these are a long tame even this low level one is gonna take a while so you're down i'm sorry it's it's really laggy and glitchy right now i'm actually now that i got them down i'm gonna restart my computer because i don't know what's going on usually when it, it after you play arc for like I don't know, a few hours or something, it starts to like kind of lag up and stuff. And I found that a computer restart usually fixes the problem. So I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But anyway, this guy's topor is dropping fast. So I better hurry. Okay, so he's been sitting here for a sec. That uh, the restart definitely helped with the lag, but he woke up in the process. So two more trank darts and he was down. So, his food is a decent a decent amount of the way down. Let's go grab us some veggies. I'm going to feed him some vegetables. I guess it wouldn't really matter. Now, vegetables tame dinosaurs at the same rate as berries. It's not any quicker, but they tame with a better efficiency. So, I mean, we want to get our full two levels out of this guy, I bet. Oh, yeah. We're probably going to get plus two levels. Not bad at all. It will tame out at seven. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> anyway, that's as much as it does. And he's been sitting for a little while now. So this is going to take probably still over an hour just to tame this level 5 one. Alright, so this dude is just taking forever. So, I found something else. I was embarrassed about the low level of this guy. So I found something attacking the base. And we're going to knock it out and tame this as well. So that it kind of makes up for it. So we've got a little terror bird action over here. I've been... 
waiting to get a few of these. I didn't want, like, I didn't want to put the effort into taming them if they were going to die. But I think I've got enough space to store them inside, start getting some kibble from these guys. But once you get a pack of these, or just them individually, they're actually really, really strong compared to what you would think. So their topor drop is really quick, actually, like the beaver. So I'll, I'll keep them on the same rotation, just tame them at the same time. So let's see here. How many darts are you going to take? Oh, he's already running. I think. Maybe? I'm going to wait a second because he looks like he's getting a little bloody. Oh, he's down. We're good. We're good. All right. Let's check it out. So, 35 Terror Bird. Um, ch -ch -ch, anything interesting? 810 health. You'll probably tame up with over a K. I usually try and at least get each dinosaur at 1,000 health because at that point, they can at least sometimes run away from things, at least lower level stuff. <laughs> so, this guy is just, oh my goodness. The amount of, of narcotics that I'm going to have to use on this is, is going to be a ton. Oh, I forgot. Oh, look at it. Looks like I'm missing a few plant species X. By the way, I got the whole circle going around the top, so we're going to have to start on turret towers next. Now, I know a bunch of people mentioned, or not a bunch, actually, I think one person or two, I don't know, a few people mentioned that I should put metal spikes around the outside. So that is something that's going to happen. So that's like the next step. Metal spikes around the outside and then turret towers behind. Ooh, free prime. Come here, you. Okay, if you guys have seen my snail down there, he's been starving to death. He only had about 100 food left. I've been saving up uh, to make these cakes. Or not saving up, but waiting until his food got low so I could feed them all to him. So I had to make some cakes up. Let's see here. How many did I get? Four? Okay. So I'm not sure how much food these actually heal or give to this guy. I'm not sure you're going to get from this. See how much he's down? I've been pumping food on him just so I can feed him. Oh my god, it's not even 200? Just so I can feed him a ton at once instead of having, you know, to make cakes all the time. I figured that would be the, the route to go. I mean, weight doesn't really help him. So, anyway, this guy's been sitting for a while. Topor is dropping real quick on that one. Not as fast as the beaver, not quite. So, he shouldn't be too bad. Now, I've got a bunch of prime. Let's see how far along he is. Nope, I don't need eggs. Come here. Okay, let's get this over there quick. Ugh. Hope it doesn't spoil. I got this a bit ago. Open. Eat up. Oh, this isn't going to be enough. It's not going to be enough. I need meat. Crap. Don't eat fast. Oh, okay. Look at that. Halfway. Oh, yeah. That, that wasn't quite enough. I mean, I wasn't too concerned about that anyway. The beaver is going to be taking a while. Oh, you're so close. All right, so we've got him. He's still that far. <laughs> so what, do we knock out the terror bird at like half tame on the beaver? And, it, and, he, and, the, uh, blah, blah, and the terror bird's almost tamed already? <laughs> That's crazy. Let's grab some more prime. There we go. I don't know why I didn't just take a sarco out here. Or maybe the saber but we'll just do this by hand we just need a few pieces oh yeah the hit come here you where are you going oh, i missed that one that's sad i need your prime man come here i don't know what you're doing I'm trying to get up into my base there we go level 20 all right, let's gather. Oh, actually, I'm gonna grab one piece of prime. But people told, keep telling me that the the spear is better for prime than the pickaxe. But I don't know. I've tried it. I've tried it a lot, and I can't, I can't tell the difference. Wait, whoa, hey, hey, cut! What do you what do you think you're doing, you stupid Dilo? What do you think you are? Let's toss this meat in here. The bird's been starving all video. <laughs> <laughs> if you haven't noticed, he's been at like half food the whole time. This guy's, I don't know, he's hungry. He's real hungry. Let me off. All right, let's go toss this in here. How close are you? Ooh, this prime might do it. Oh, he just ate as we're walking up. So we're going to have to wait. Okay, but he should almost be done. This guy's still got quite a bit of time on him. Ooh, you're, you're running low. Okay, this beaver's almost set. 
I think this will be the last narcotics that we'll need for him. So let's see here. What are you at? Oh, he's one eat away. I don't even want to use these, but I'm going to do it just in case. So, okay, there you go. Terror Bird is all tamed up over here. Tamed up at 49, not too bad. What are we talking for health? Yes, we made it over a thousand. We've got, I don't know, I don't know how the melee damage scales on these guys because they have a really, really strong melee damage compared to their size, of course. Oh, they're quick. This is nice. Okay, let's test them out. So we can flutter around on this guy. Woo! Check. Oh, and we can actually take a weapon out. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, hey. Oh, did I miss? That stinks. Let's go kill that thing. Oh, he's running. Yeah, you better run, dude. Where are you going? Oh, he's got a dart in his tail. I didn't miss. Look at that. There's a dart in his tail. That should have counted. All right. Now I'm going to kill you. Oh, hey, hey, whoa, 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 let go of me. <laughs> what is this? Get off. If I just attack straight, is that going to hit him? Is this hitting? I don't know. It looks like there's blood splatter. It doesn't make any sense, but okay, he's dead. Yeah, take that. I didn't know that they could pick up a terror bird. Hmm, that might be easier to tame. Uh, okay, I guess we have an Argent, so we can pick up terror birds that way. But if we're ever out with the Capra Suchus, I now know that. <laughs> So let's get this guy back. That beaver should be all set. Hey, oh! Yeah, you, you deserved it. What are you doing in here? That close? It didn't make a noise. Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa. I was, I was spamming the space bar. Hey, guy! Look at that. Level 7. Came out with the best taming efficiency a level 5 possibly can. Look at this bad boy. Okay. Let's see here. What is this saddle going to cost us? I started putting the resources in there, but it's ridiculous. It's like a really expensive saddle. I think I just needed hide. But the reason behind that is that the saddle is also a smithy. So when you're out and about, you can repair your items and weapons and build anything you want that a smithy can. So let's toss that in here. But look at the requirements. So much hide. 100 cementing paste. I mean, it's quite a bit. So build that thing up. I've got a ton of metal in here, by the way, as you can see. I've been stocking up. I'm, I'm getting ready to make the rest of the base metal. So I got to start working on some foundations for this room. This will probably be the next metal room now that this one's completed. But anyway, let's see here. Get you some armor because you are weak. Little guy. All right. There we go. And see now, in his inventory, we can craft whatever we'd like. We can craft new ammo if we want to when we're out and about. But that'll be more for when we get a really high level one. That'll be the next beaver we tame will be really high. But this one's not too bad. Look at, I mean, the movement speed on these is actually pretty quick. The weight is going to be much better than 300. Because he's only got 300 weight, but their special ability is that they one-fifth wood i believe the si the weight of wood and then one third the weight of stone i believe that's what it goes after so let's see here i'm gonna go test this guy out uh, or you know what i'm gonna wait for daytime dude get back here what are you running away from me for get back here oh my goodness let me let me oh i'm gonna i'm gonna be so mad at you dude okay fine just go up there he's following the beaver anyway so this is what we've got. I've got the saber to protect us, and I've got the dodicarus so that I can gather stone, and now we've got the beaver to gather wood. So this is awesome. I'm really excited to be able to take these out because now we just need another pariser, and then we can throw a platform saddle on it, and we've got, like, a whole gathering army. So that's awesome. Let's see here. So he can run and attack. Oh, he actually gets a decent amount of time just because he can move really quickly. So I might use him for berries as well. I've, I've been using the Ankylo, and that really sucks. <laughs> so let's jump up here. Let's go test out a tree. See how much he gets from a redwood tree. Now remember, extinction event is going on. So this is two times rates right now on the official server. So that's why this is so much wood. But oh my god, 300 wood. And that doesn't even really make his inventory or his weight move at all, which is so awesome. Because wood has been such a problem for me. We're just going to buff so much weight. Oh, yeah. Shake that butt. <laughs> Slaps the tail. Okay, that's great. All right. Is this a tree I can gather? Cool. 
And look at that. Not even raising his weight is all. Really, I, f I filled up like, no, no. Oh, no. Please, no. Did I make that mad? Oh, God. I hate, I hate Dimorphs. I hate them so much. Their hitbox is horrible, so you can almost never hit them on a dinosaur unless it's a tall dinosaur. Oh, my God. Go away. Saber. Help me. Help me. I can't do this. Die. Okay. Oh, no. Beaver, don't. Don't do this. Don't do this, beaver. Pass it. Why are you on neutral? Oh my god, I hate these dino... Okay, so... Problem I have... Okay, we're just going to have to sit here for a second. Problem I have with these dino commands is if you're on a different group ordering, your, your other dinosaurs won't listen to you when you tell them to go passive. And that I think they should always listen to passive, because that's... Uh, gets you in some really rough or some really crappy situations. So, yes, go on the saber. Do not go on the beaver, because you've already almost... Okay, this is doing a lot of damage to the beaver. I'm going to get group ordering off, so that I can put this guy on passive. Okay, now stop moving. Oh my god. Oh, he's following me. Okay, but he's not on attack. So now let's see if we can reach this stupid dinosaur. I got all short dinosaurs. We're all short. Leave us alone. Jeez. Oh, oh my god. Watch, we, we lose our beaver to just one stupid glitchy dimor. Oh my god. You better die, dude. He's already getting bloody. No. Let's go away. I didn't even do it. I didn't mean to do it. We, this is, it wasn't on purpose. Lee, why you gotta be so mad? Alright. This is getting kind of ridiculous. Give these guys a better hitbox. Holy crap. And now we've got lag, too. Oh my god. You dead yet? What level are you even? 75? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You, you twirl like that. Crazy ragdoll. Okay. Brother, you did like half our beaver's health right there. We need to be careful with this. I'm going to go put him into the metal part of the base, and he's going to sit there until he gets levels, because this is this is just unacceptable. But anyway, um, the weight is great. I mean, you can't complain about that. What I really want to do with this beaver is probably throw him on a raft and use him to gather in the swamp, um, because that'll be really nice. But anyway... I'm going to gather some stone with this guy, because I, I might as well since we're out here, and then we'll test out. That saber's coming over here. I saw him. I saw you. <laughs> Get out of here, dude. Oh, this is going to take forever with the tail. Come here. Sorry if I hit you, Dodicarus, but I'm not trying to deal with this saber. Go away, man. Leave me alone. Okay, this is this is this is just what what? I didn't mean to get off. Oh now he's following the beaver. Yeah, you do that. What is happening? Okay, okay. Kill it. Please. Kill it. Finally killed it. Okay. Jeez, I probably should have just used the saber, but what are you gonna do? Now, this guy is actually really nice. He's got such a high health pool, and once he once he gets low, he'll just roll up into a ball. So I don't think we'll have to worry about losing this guy. He's got a ton of health, like over 4K health. So let's head back to base, get these resources back. It's going to be really nice to have this beaver, but I, I'm sad that he's so low level. We'll have to get another one soon. I apologize that he's only level 5. I was looking for something a lot higher, but, you know, arc sometimes works that way but that's where we're going to stop for today we got our beaver we got a start on a terror bird army so if you like the video and you like the series definitely hit that thumbs up on this one thanks a ton for all the support so far on this series it's been freaking phenomenal and i appreciate the crap out of all of you so you all have a great rest of your day and we will catch you next time